Welcome back to Academy TV. It's Wessex Premier League action. We missed the kickoff. We're at Laverstock and Ford Sports Club. It's Laverstock and Ford versus Harvey Dibden. Wessex Premier League action. Harvey Dibden in the red. Rarely see him in the red, to be fair, but obviously we've got some green hoopers here. Keep your eye on this game. Oh, he injured himself. Missed that when I was over. Oh, fair play. Not sure what happened after that. It's just the goals, really, and the key moments that we share in the highlights. All the best. Hopefully he's not done too much. Fair play for putting it out, though. Rally in. Is it a forced change already? Lava stock. It's good pressing from Hyde. Didn't quite work out, though. On the back of that semi-final defeat to Shailen. That is a hell of a ball and it's a hell of a goal. Roach, 19 minutes in. Puts Laverstock one to the good. Let's have a look at the replay. Blink and you miss it. Look at this ball. And look at this finish. Boom. Love that. 1-0. That is a, one of the best goals I've seen in a while. And we do lots of videos. Technique, pure technique that is. Hive on the ball, just sent him to Tesco's. That won't be getting short, that's not quite Tesco getting sent to Tesco standard. Good interception there. Stuck there a little bit, wrong footed on the pass. Not a bad knock. Shout to the line, eh? Miles on side. Hive just recycling that at the back. Spray it out to the left-hand side. He's on the overlap. He's got no option. He's going to have to come back, isn't he? He's pinged that. That's not a bad knock. It's a good area. Blocked. Bit scrappy, isn't it? Scrappy game so far. There was a lot of passing about. We're not really about that. There's a throw in for Hive then. Plenty of Hive bodies around. It's had too much time, I know. Not really, not really getting close enough to him there for me. Oh, his defender's missed it. It's back post. He's put it across the face of goal. He's on side. It's in the back of the net. Rawkins. 26 minutes doubles the lead. Two to the good. That ball's just been sent over to the abyss. This place must be in the middle of nowhere. A couple of house lights in the distance over there, but it is dark in the abyss around the pitch. Spooky. Good finish. Hive's mistake, really, that was. Got to deal with them balls coming through. Hive on the ball. Intercepted. Just that scrappy, isn't it? A little bit end to end. Not really many passes. No, we wouldn't say anyone's really in control of the game. Again, battling away in the midfield. Oh, strength for the man. And again, he's too strong. He's got his gym membership. A little bit knock and hit and hope. It's a shouts for handball. It's not been given. And it's in the back of the net. Plumber. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. 41 minutes. Important time to score, that is. Just before half time. It's going to make the Gaffers team talk a little bit easier. Gives everyone a little bit of hope. Don't know how many fans travelled up for this midweek game. Always awkward. Shouts for handball there. Refs was in a good position. Liner didn't say anything. Handball rule's gone a little bit mental for me, in all honesty. I preferred it when it was... Uh, if it was ball to hand, play on. Or do this unnatural position. It's not really for me. Tell them I'm getting old now. Love a start on forward on the ball. Don't want to concede another one before the half-time whistle. Ivan Dibden don't also want to concede another one. If that ain't quality commentary, I don't know what is. Are they looking for another one here? Too much time. And that's over. Wide and over. 
We have a stock on the ball. Nice chest down. It's hooked. Can't be long left of this half. Come on, ref. I know we had to uh, pull up with the injury at the beginning, but nothing else really. Chance for another attack here. Who's tracking number four back post? Side netting, side netting. I think the keeper had it covered as well. Referee does blow for half time there. Cameron Roach, Jacob Brawkins with the goals for Lavis looking forward. Lyrone, I hope I'm saying it right. Plummer, might be saying it wrong. Could be completely wrong. 2 1 at half time to Lava Stock on Ford. All to play for in the second half. Just see how this one pans out. And we're underway. Do midweek games play a part in the result? I think they do personally. People have worked. Have they eaten right? Have they worked really hard? Stressful day at work. Late night kickoff. It's not like a six aside league. Only half an hour long, it's a full 90. Keeper sends that up. Must work on getting the team sheets next season if we're going to carry on with eyes. Love doing the videos, but I need some names. I want to be able to chuck some names out there. Quick photo of the team sheet. Big head of that. 2 1. This game is still very open. Not a bad knock. He's turned. He's hit it. It's in. Oh, no, it's off the bar. I did a little short. I said it rattled the bar. Got a few comments. Apparently, it was just a nudge. We'll stick with a nudge. It's hardly rattling the bar, but it's coming off the bar. Rattling sounds better, doesn't it? Since when has media been true to what they say? Got to make it sound better. Looking for that breakthrough. Another shot. Good save for the keeper. He spilled it, though. And he gets it well up there. End to end at the moment. Shouts for offside. I'm going to post a still of that because when I look at it and you line it up, when the ball was played, it was off. Just, right. I'd say the line was right there. Tough one to call, especially with like, the angles from the dugouts and that. Lava stock looking good in this game. I think I've ended up with footage from him a couple of times. Might be in the hive game. That I've also recorded. Oh, uh, got his shot away. I don't even think that counts over. To be fair, this is it. This is going to be the last kick of the game. Have we got a Desmond Tutu last minute equaliser? This is it. We're already in extra time. Injury time. Not extra time. And he's hit the ball. He's turned it though. This is where the referee confused me. He's going to shoot there. It was going to go top bins. The whistle put him off as he was going to do it. Referee blows. We didn't even get much left on the end. It's kind of gone back to the beginning. Uh, obviously, the gaffer wanted to get out there. I said it was late night kickoff. Thanks for watching Academy TV. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Leave a comment if you can. See you next time.